There's one in every office. The person that's bad at washing their coffee cup. You know the one, the favorite mug that's so discolored it's hard to tell if there's coffee in it or not. Believe it or not, it's not as gross as it seems. In fact, in some instances, it may be better to just not wash out your coffee cup. Here's why. Germ theory. The Wall Street Journal asked Baylor College of Medicine infectious disease expert Jeffrey Stark just what's going on in those unwashed mugs of disgustingness, and he says not a whole heck of a lot. Stark says if you're in a public office environment and you leave your coffee mug in your personal space, there's going to be germs in it, but a lot of them are your germs, so they won't make you sick. So it's totally fine to just not wash your daily coffee drinking mug, as long as you're not sharing it with anybody else. And in a public office, it might actually be your most sanitary option, oddly enough, because offices are gross. University of Arizona professor of environmental microbiology Charles Gerba published a study in 2017 that included some startling and gross findings, especially if you leave your mug in the office kitchen. According to Gerba, up to 90% of mugs in office kitchens are covered in germs, and 20% contain fecal matter. <laughs> And those nasty communal sponges are likely to blame. Gerba told Men's Health the nastiest bacteria he found living in office coffee cups comes from the shared sponges and scrub brushes everyone uses, thinking they're getting their mugs sparkling clean. They're actually just spreading the germs around, and these germs can live in your cup for as long as three days. Did you wash your hands, Stanley? I bet you didn't. So you're better off keeping your precious mug at your desk, away from all that potential nastiness, but only if you take it black. Cream and sugar complications. The case for not washing your coffee mug at all is looking pretty good at this point, but you also need to factor in just what you're drinking out of it. If you like your coffee black, you're fine. But if you add cream, sugar, or flavored syrups, it's a different story. Professor Stark notes that leaving cream and sugar residue in a mug for extended periods of time will lead to mold. So in that case, it's best to take it home every night and wash it with the rest of your dishes. It's the price you gotta pay for that extra bit of indulgence. The Navy Excuse So you've decided to not wash that favorite office mug you use for black coffee and keep safely at your desk. Nicely done! But what if your coworkers give you grief over your ugly mug? First, make them watch this video. Then, give them the Navy excuse. The Naval Historical Foundation says not washing coffee mugs is a proud military tradition. Some see a stained coffee mug blackened by years of use as a symbol of the time they spent serving their country. Others say seasoning the mug makes their coffee taste better, or measure how long they've been deployed by how dark the cup gets. One blogger puts it this way, You may not be able to embrace your loved ones while you are gone, but at least you can still taste the same coffee you drank the day you left. So, if Janice from accounting turns her nose up at your well-seasoned choice of Java receptacle, ignore her snobbery and drink up, knowing you're taking part in a time-honored tradition. Plus, you're far less likely to be drinking fecal matter. It's a win-win. <coughs> Thanks for watching. Click the mashed icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.